All right, you guys, we got another collaboration with Fave Trip today. Make sure you go check them out. Now, we're going to be paying attention to the three scallywags walking in the door. Now, the first guy's going to look up at the counter. Then the second guy's going to look up at the counter. Then the third guy's going to look up at the counter. You know, they all got to look up at the counter because thieves love looking up at the counter. Now, as you can see, they are all looking for something, but apparently they're having a hard time finding it. But Mr. Green Jacket just found what he was looking for. So he's going to make his way towards the counter and he's going to move that broom out of the way because he needs to grab a delicious case of H2O. Now, unfortunately for them, they got to wait for this nice young lady and her daughter to finish checking out before they can pull the scam that they're going to pull. So they finish checking out and they're up next. So he's got the case of water in hand and he's going to make his way up to the counter and set it down. Hey, yo, man, let me get a pack of those uh, Rillos right over there. I know you got a hundred packs, but you, you can tell which one I'm pointing at, right? Yeah, I'm pointing at that one right there. No, not that one, not that one. If you go up two levels and then to the left and then to the right diagonally, you'll see which one I'm talking about. Yeah, that one right there. Grab me a pack of those and then uh, I kind of want another pack. How about, uh, how about that one right there? Yeah, you see where I'm pointing, right? Yeah, that one right there. No, not that one. If you go down to the left, and then over to the right three more spaces and then down two levels you'll see what I'm talking about yeah that one right there can you grab me one of those two and give me another one of those packs right there yeah that'll do that'll do I appreciate it thanks little buddy actually let me take a look at these real quick I don't know if these are the right ones yeah I don't I don't want these ones right here but I do want these two so ring me up for those two and then this pack that you grabbed that's the wrong pack I don't want those ones so you can put those back for me thanks sir now if you were paying attention you just saw that the guy with his hood up installed a credit card skimmer on the credit card machine oh you didn't see that all right let's take a look again now if you look at the right side of the screen you're gonna see him grab the shield that surrounds the keypad. Once he yanks that off, he's going to put it into his left pocket, as you can see right here on the left side of the screen. Yep. Now, once that shield's gone, he can easily place the skimming device over top of the original credit card machine. So once he gets that out of his pants, you're going to see him pull it out, and he's going to slip it right over top. And now it looks like a normal credit card machine, and you would never notice the difference. Now, as you just saw, with the help of Mr. Green Jacket as the distraction, it took all of 20 seconds to install that bad boy. So the point of this is, is they installed the skimmer over top, it looks like a normal credit card machine. It functions like a normal credit card machine, except every time somebody inserts their card or swipes it, it's stealing the credit card information. So when they come back later to remove the skimming device, they can get all that card info. Now, the dumbest thing you can do after installing one of these is look directly at a camera and give that camera a really good look at your face. Mr. Green Jacket is definitely not the brightest in the group. Now, the other two, they did a pretty good job of hiding their faces from the camera, not nearly as identifiable, and you never really get a clear good shot of their face. So. Hopefully somebody can ID these guys because they definitely deserve to go to jail. Now, he's going to grab his water and he's going to pass the M&Ms off to his buddy and they're going to make their way out the door. Unfortunately, they were smart enough to park their car elsewhere. As you can see, they're walking to the business next door. I'm assuming they parked over there. So there is no license plate number and there is no vehicle description. Now, as you see, this looks like a pretty normal credit card machine. Most people would not question it. But if you're ever skeptical, just do what my hand model does right here. He's going to grab that corner and he's going to give a little jiggle. See it wobbling? If it's wobbling, chances are you do not want to swipe your card or insert the chip because it's probably a skimmer. So that's the best way to find out. As you can see, it slips right on like normal. Looks like a normal credit card machine until you pull it off and look at the back and see, whoa, that's a credit card skimmer. Luckily, they found it in time and nobody's information was compromised. If you know these thieves, please let us know who they are or you can tell them to turn themselves into the local authorities so we can properly have them charged and sent to jail.